a group of Russian war prisoners at a Ukrainian colony on January 17. On Friday, UN issued a report on Friday, emphasizing execution executions, tortures and other examples violating international human rights laws in treatment prisoners Russia and Ukraine. Big the report found that another UN report last week made a series of violations of Russian forces in Ukraine, which means war crimes and possible crimes against humanity. Details the latest report of the United Nations High Commissioner of Human Rights is based negotiations with more than 400 POW, and focuses on how Russia has been treated in a year since its attack Ukraine. Among discussions are the Ukrainian POWs and Russians who were captured in Ukraine. The UN monitor said that the powers held by Russia were not given confidential access. They found monitors documented violations in the treatment of POWs. Among examples under control Russia, the executions 15 POW, use POWs as human shields, S2 wounded men POW due to lack medical care and other ill treatment to get torture or information report. The monitors also documented a widespread application, as in extreme crowded vehicles without access to water or toilets, under the hands of the ambassadors and in human conditions, in human, tied and covered eyes. The monitors met with 24 women POW held by Russia, and 17 of them were subject to beating, electric shock, forced nudity, space calls and sexual violence threats. Meanwhile, monitors documented the summary executions of at least 25 Russian powers in hands of Ukrainian forces. Oker also documented torture or other forms of ill treatment against the 113 power, many of them contain beating kicking or less stabbing, he says. Note the ill treatment of the powers took place on both sides, but was much more common to Ukrainians. What do they say Matilda Bogner, President U.S. monitoring mission in Ukraine, stated that at a press conference in Kiev, while both sides abused, Russia's occupation of Ukraine was at the center violence against AP Get Deeper report Russia moved for 6,000 Ukrainian children to re-allowance.